Hi, I'm your ECD Hub coach, and this is magazine letter writing. What you'll need is a paper, it could be large or small, a magazine, some scissors, a marker, and some tape or glue. What I'm first going to do is write the alphabet. So I'm going to start with the alphabet in uppercase, and I could also do the same activity in lowercase letters. So I'm going to first write the alphabet to this side. Okay, so I've written the letter alphabet on two sides. You could also do two sheets of paper if you only wanted the alphabet on one side of the paper. But to save paper, I'm going to just use one and do the alphabet on two of the sides. Now I'm going to open my magazine and I'm going to look for uppercase letters. So I found a C right here. So I'm going to cut this letter out. Now it doesn't have to be cut out beautifully. I'm just gonna cut out this C and I'm gonna paste it by the C that I wrote. And remember I'm looking for uppercase letters because that will also stretch out this activity and allow um, children to identify the difference between upper and lowercase. So I put my C right here and I'm going to continue to investigate this magazine and look for more uppercase letters. So I also see a T. So I'm going to cut that T out. I'm going to tape it to where the T is. Now, if you don't have any magazines at home, what you can also do is get a, um, a grocery store weekly ad um, that you see at the front of a grocery store, and that could work as well because that also has letters. So I found a T. So I'm going to continue to do two more. See a, see a big R over here. So I'm going to put this R where the R is. And take it right there. One more uppercase letter. I see a nice L. So I'm going to cut out this L. Now, this is a really great activity to keep because um, your kids would be very proud of the work that they did. This also is an activity that can last for quite a while. So, if you're looking for a time saving activity um, or a t uh, an activity that might take a while, this would be a perfect activity to do. Um, and also a child could do a lot of it on their own. So it's a really good independent activity as long as you have supervision and the right scissors that they are using. So this is what my activity looks like. Again, I can go all the way to the end and I can also have two sheets of paper um, and allow my student or child to look at letters um, in the magazine. You could also do this activity with letters that your child is struggling with. So if my child is struggling with maybe five letters, I could maybe only choose five letters for the sheet and allow them to investigate um, letters in a magazine. So this activity is also really nice because it allows students to see and children to see um, how letters are written in different type font. Um, and in exploring um, a different magazine and different uh, letter, letter faces. 
So this is Letter Writing with Magazines and I'm your ECD Hub coach.